Hey gang, this is Jeremy, and uh, this is my PS3, and I'm going to show you how to put this in safe mode. So, we're going to start off with, I'm just making sure the TV's turned on, it usually helps. Oh, Alright, this is safe mode, so this is uh, usually the first thing that you do if there's any issues, and this is not the same thing say if your PlayStation got shut off um, when there's power and asks if you want to check the disc uh, this is completely different so this is a safe mode I'm going to show you how to do it first you start with the red light push and hold the power button see how I'm still holding it okay you've got to keep after the first beep you have to keep holding on and it will turn off Next time, there we go. Now I gotta let go. Alright. Now we have to repeat this process where I'm going to push the button and it's going to, after five seconds, beep again. And another five seconds, it's gonna double beep like that. And then now it says connect the controller to the USB cable, which it is. And now, this is where you have the options. Obviously, the restart system is in case you accidentally got there. Restore default settings. That's your settings. That doesn't have anything to do with your data. Like your game saves and stuff. Restore file system. This is typically what you're going to end up doing uh, if maybe you have some kind of corrupt file system or kind of issues with playing games, things like that. Rebuilding the database as the, uh, the game saves and things like that. Restore the PS3 system. Uh, that's basically setting it to the way it was when your system first came to you. And system update is obviously the to update the system either. Uh, the way it works is um, Usually you have to plug in like a flash drive or something. Um, Alright, thank you very much gang.